how would you improve the self-confidence of like uh, companies in Europe? If it's anything like an individual, how do you improve your self-confidence? Well, I mean, you have to take stock of, of your strengths yeah. and, and know what you're doing. If, if yeah. you have a product before you can really expect your business to be, yeah. uh, you know, thriving, how are you as yeah. a person? How's your mentality? Because if you're a CEO or if you're an entrepreneur, your endeavors are going to be a reflection of your personality, mm. right? Yeah. So if you believe in yourself and you feel, if you feel capable and strong, then those things are going to flow from you and your ideas can, can flow without the obstruction of, oh, you know, I can't, that, that phrase, yeah. that phrase, I can't. Well, I think maybe the backup is, well, well why can't I? Or, or rather, how can I? Mm. Maybe just a little slight change in the language. I yeah. found that to, to help me a lot um, in my life. You know, and if, when it comes to a business, um, no, you know what? Not just a business, just as a person. You know, if you say, you know, I know that I that I really, really enjoy playing guitar. I really enjoy singing, and I really enjoy these songs that I wrote, and I put a lot of myself into them. Um, why not try recording them? Why not try sharing? Yeah, them why not? Yeah, it's why ask not? right question. Why not? Yeah. Why not? And you know what? What's the worst that can happen? Yeah. Like, oh, I get on stage and I play, and maybe I forget the words or yeah. I'm booed, and people say, oh, that's no good. But yeah. you know what? It doesn't matter because yeah. if you're secure as a person, you say, I know that mm. I like this and I enjoyed making yeah. this, then it doesn't really matter what other people yeah. think. Yeah, and when you are like developing and iterating your business model, like the usually it's like only thing you lose is maybe your time and, and sure. effort. And every time like when you start doing something, you try to do something, maybe you fail, but still you are above that level like when you started. So yeah. it's always like improves you like when you're doing this iteration and trying to, to make, make change. Yeah, you know, when you're learning Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, just because you, get, you submit and you're in a match with somebody and you, you give up, you tap out, that doesn't take away from you. You actually gained experience from, from losing that is going to make you a better fighter later. Uh, and it's the same with, let's say, getting up on stage and totally failing and getting booed you gained experience so like you said it wasn't a waste of your time yeah. it's all going into you know your own bucket it's mm. your experience bucket and experience is everything wow. you know, how many times have you have you tried something and failed i mean every any successful person in the world doesn't matter if they're an athlete or a business or an actor or a politician how many times have they tried and failed more times than the people who are not successful. I would mm -hmm. bet money on that. <laughs>